Today we will be going to Lupan in Davao Oriental with Tita Melanie and Marlin from the Somal expedition trip. I just finished uploading that video so it is now live on the YouTube channel. Good morning! How are you? Are you excited? My first festival. Your first festival ever? Yeah. Hi. I'm Marlon's eldest and Linnell. What should I expect from the festival? Food. <laughs> food? Lechon. Lots of food. Lechon? Oh, games, games. I've seen some wild rides here. Lupan is a four-hour car ride from Davao City and only 30 minutes away from Mati, where I helped clean up the beach and visited the mangrove sanctuary. Tito Marlin is from Lupan and we were going to meet him at his house there. I hadn't seen him since our scuba dive expedition to Somal Island, so I was excited to see him again. Hi. Ah, good to see you. How's your travel? It was good. Good time na. It's time to eat. It's on. It's big. My lechon is big. Oh. Food is what connects Filipino people together. I remember growing up, even in the US, whenever we would gather with friends and family, it would always be around an enormous amount of food. Precious memories, conversations, and relationships are made over food. It's central to Filipino culture, community, and celebration. In this case, the fiesta. It's a running joke when my whole family is together that we eat every two hours, which can be too much. <laughs> but also, it's not about the food for us. It's about the company and just being together. I get, have you eaten yet? More than how are you doing when I first meet a Filipino or someone in the Philippines. Food is a sign of love and affection. The highlight for this meal for me was definitely the lechon or roasted pig. I kept snacking on it even after this meal until it was time to go to Tito Mar Marlin's cousin's home, the Manalos, for another meal before the carnival. Hey, Sandra. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Nice to meet you. What's He's a cousin of Marlin. Andre Benedict. Andre Benedict. Hi. Hi. Happy fiesta. Welcome to the fall. Yeah. Sharon J. Manalo. Yeah. Seven. So this is our family, the Manalo family. Uh, cheers. Yeah. Hi. Hi. First fiesta in the Philippines. There was a brownout during our meal, but it didn't stop us from having a good time. This dish is chickenada. What's this? Chickenada. What is this? The carnival was a short five minute walk from the Manalo house and we started the night with some target practice with airsoft guns. What I love about Tito Marlin and Tita Melanie is that they are kids inside who just want to have fun. By the end of the game, we got pretty good at shooting those targets and I was warmed up for the bigger rides. Tito Marlin and Tita Melanie opted not to join the bigger rides, but fortunately we met up with Tito Marlin's nieces and nephews who joined me. Good. It was fun. <laughs> 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 
After the carnival, we left for the pier in the back of a pickup truck, which was a first for me. At the pier, we enjoyed live music, food, and the company of the locals of Lupin to end this amazing fiesta experience. It is the next morning. We are going to be heading back to Davao. Before we go back, we are going to visit the rice fields outside of Lupon. I also want to say thank you to Tito Marlin for hosting the parties, giving us the food and preparing everything. And Tito Melanie for also driving and having the company. <laughs> At the rice fields, Tito Marlin and Tita Melanie surprised me with a kite, and it soared no. over Lupon. So we moved to a different location, so we didn't have to run anymore by the beach. No running required here. It's good. As I was making this video, I was thinking about why I love creating travel experiences to share with you all. A big reason is because I have so many memories that are just that, memories. There are friends and people who are closest to me that I will never see again in those memories and creating videos of people I meet and experiences I have will allow me to have them forever. So when I say I'll see you in the next video, I really mean it. I hope you enjoyed this experience and decide to stay with me and subscribe for more adventures.